You might have watched many videos on YouTube or you might have heard from people that things can be welded together using salty water. Today we have chosen the same topic and want to share with you. We'll see together whether things are welding together salty water or not. If yes, then up to which level is it true? We'll also discover whether this procedure is safe or unsafe, real or fake. Let's perform together and see the result. As you saw in the video, we are arraying the welding system in the items used in this system. Safety is first when it comes to performing an experiment, so we will use gloves for safety. We'll check it now whether it really works or not. One end of the wire is connected to the extension cord, which produces a current of 220 volts. We connected another wire to the extension cord, which produces the same amount of current but this end is connected to an iron piece at the end. Both wires connected to the extension cord produces a current of 220 volts. One wire is connected to the bolt and there is water salt in the jar. The current is passed through the water and salt and outflows through the other bolt. The other wire is connected to the iron piece. From this, it is clear that each wire from the extension cord produces a current of 220 volts. The amount of current used in this project is very dangerous for human beings. Each wire produces a current of 220 volts. Don't try this project at home. Now let's check the reality of the project. When we connected the welding rod with the iron piece, it was like connecting two wires together, each wire producing a current of 220 volts. Looking at the current, the jar, salt and bolt and water seem useless and meaningless. The jar doesn't have any significant role in this project. The welding rod sparks like the real weld, but we'll see whether it can stick to things together like the real weld or not. Two iron pipes were taken for examination. As you can see, it can spark like the real weld, but it can stick two things together. It looks like real weld, but it isn't weld in reality. It is too dangerous. Now you knew the reality of this project. So you are requested to stay away from this project. Besides high voltage, it raises the temperature of water to a higher degree and the boiling water may cause a serious damage. Once again, you are requested to stay away from performing or trying to perform this activity in the house. Thanks for watching.